Hey guys, it is Thursday morning. Just waking up, hanging out with Mom and Gary. Yeah. Mama wanted to go get some pumpkins. And while we were out, we also went to the dump and dropped off a freezer that was broken, I guess. I've never been to the dump before, so that was kind of neat. And, uh, yeah, before we uh, picked up a pumpkin, we checked out some thrift stores. I like this one. I didn't find anything that I actually wanted, but, you know, it's one of the decent ones. They had a Cuphead mask. That was kind of cool. But, uh, yeah, we did go to a couple other ones. Then we went over to a farmer market stall kind of thing to get a pumpkin. There were six dollars for like a regular size and three dollars for the mini ones. And I guess that's okay, you know, it's a little bit more expensive than like uh, no frills, but uh, that's local, so that's good. And I was thinking about what I was going to carve my pumpkin as. Then we uh, decided to go out again. I think Gary wanted to get some groceries or something, so... Went over to the no frills, got some stuff. For, uh, you know, upcoming Thanksgiving meals. And, uh, yeah, gonna go hang out by their secret lake that they like to chill out at. We got some Tim Hortons sipping on some uh, hot chocolate here. I think they were curious about the uh, fall colors. And there was a couple of trees that I tried to uh, change. Standing out in some pretty nice colors there. And, uh, yeah, we did walk down the path a little bit here. Apparently there's five people that own that land now, and they're gonna build five houses on it. So that's neat, I guess. Anyways, unloaded the groceries. I helped, uh, with the roast, peeled some carrots and stuff. Now, back to carving the pumpkin. I've, uh, hollowed out most of the gunk. Uh, started covering away. Yeah, I kind of regret having the Sharpie because now I have all these Sharpie marks that I didn't cut out. That's kind of what inspired me to carve out the teeth a little bit more. And then it's just like white teeth kind of thing. It's kind of a cool effect. I think it turned out all right. So, uh, yeah. Hung out for a while. Diane came by to hang out, and that's good to see her. We lit up the pumpkin. It's looking decent. Yeah, Diane went home before uh, dinner. But uh, yeah, it was good uh, dinner. Beef roast with rice and veggies. That was some good stuff. Then we kind of just hung out and watched a movie. I was seeing online that there is a chance that you can see the Northern Lights right now. So I went out front and looked around, but couldn't really see anything. You know, too many street lights. But I think I saw an owl. At least like a really big wing. Like behind me. It's not on the video, but I don't know, I saw something. A big bird flying around at night. Probably an owl. So anyways, we went back to their secret lake area to see if we could see the northern lights. And with our bare eyes, it was kind of hard to see. But the camera was picking it up. So we decided to go a little bit further north. And uh, yeah, we just kind of stopped at some random uh, farm fields. And I got some pretty good pictures. You could actually really see it with your eyes now. I mean, not quite as nice as in the uh, pictures. But I was seeing it. So that was pretty cool. We went a little bit further north to see uh, if anything was changing, and you could still see it around. It seemed like maybe it was fading, I don't know. But uh, we were out there for like an hour looking at stuff, so it was a pretty good time. Definitely saw it. We got back and I ate a midnight bagel before heading off to bed. Later guys. <laughs>